This is your Friday Night Forecast. I'm Chief Meteorologist Nicholas Ferreri. At tonight's football games, temperatures in the 40s, so have all those fall layers on. And no, there is a slight chance of a sprinkle or two during the course of tonight's games, but most games will not be impacted. Futurecast displays this slight chance, kind of a very hit and miss thing. Remember, this is basically a sprinkle when we equate it to what's on the ground uh, as it falls. Then on our Saturday morning, it's all the picture. Saturday is going to be a mainly dry day. Overall, a mostly cloudy day, but there could very well be some moments where the sun is peeking on through. The chill in the air, it remains high temperatures only in the 50s then, and another day with highs in the 50s on Sunday. On Sunday, our next weather system starts to uh, bring in rain or as early as the morning. This is 11 o'clock with the rain moving in from southwest to northeast. Periods of rain then throughout the afternoon into the evening, and you can see here on the map, nearly continuous, covering the entire area, and pockets of some heavy rain. This could be similar to that last heavy rainfall event we had just a few weeks back. Some spots, by the time all is said and done with this, across our Sunday and Monday, because the rain chance does carry into Monday, could see more than three inches of rainfall. So if you live in a spot that tends to flood, keep an eye out and stay alert. Here's a look at the next 10 days. 56 are Saturday high, Sunday 55, Monday 56, Tuesday mostly sunny, 59. On Wednesday, 62 with some rain. Thursday and Friday, some rain possible. Highs in the 50s. Staying in the 50s next weekend. The Halloween forecast still looks good. Some sunshine, some scattered clouds, and a high temperature in the upper 50s. That's your latest forecast update.